Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I am making low carb corned beef hash using cauliflower instead of traditional potatoes. So I've chopped up a whole lot of cauliflower over there. It's a massive cauliflower, so it's about a quarter of the cauliflower I'm using. So maybe half of a whole one, a quarter of a massive one, depending how many people you're going to feed. This is for myself and my husband, so there's heaps here. Yeah. And I've also chopped up a couple of cloves of garlic over there for flavour. And the star of the dish is the corned beef or silver side. I've shared a tutorial before how to make this yourself from scratch. Super, super easy. I will leave a link down below and an information cards for you to check it out. I have melted heaps and heaps and heaps of butter in my frying pan. I got a new frying pan. I love these red spot ones. They let you know when it's ready to be cooked on and it's just about now it's nice and hot my butter is bubbly so we will add the cauliflower and garlic into the frying pan and really it's just a matter of cooking this until it is done to your liking so the smaller you cut the pieces of cauliflower the quicker it would be I like to cut mine in mixed little shapes and the little bits might get a more brown and then the bigger bits a bit more tender it kind of goes against the rules everyone usually says cut things uniform but I like a bit of a mixed texture when in the finished product so kind of mix it around and then just leave it alone a bit to brown up a bit and um, if you think it needs a bit more butter add more butter as you go but I am just going to cook this until it is beautiful and golden and just add any seasoning of choice I'm just going with a bit of salt. You can use salt, pepper, any other seasoning that you like. And I'm making this this week because if you didn't already know, it's St. Patrick's Day coming up in a couple of days and Ireland has a soft spot in my heart. We went there last year on holiday, probably going to go there on holiday again next year. It's just one of my favourite places in the world. So I love Irish cuisine, I love Irish countryside, the people, the food, everything. So um, I had to make some sort of dish and make it nice and keto friendly. So instead of the potatoes, of course, I have gone with cauliflower. So we're going to cook these and um, enjoy it for our St. Patrick's Day feast. See a little bit of colour coming up. That's what we like. Give it a nice mix. Maybe add a smidge more butter into the mix. Make this beautiful high fat. Yeah, that's what we want. And you see the small little pizzas are getting nice and brown and oh the garlic's browning as well and those bigger pieces just kind of go tender kind of like potatoes there we go we've got some beautiful color on that look at the golden color oh yeah some bits are getting a bit crispier and now is the perfect time to just move that aside and add in our corned beef so pop that in there and give it a stir through and the cat has come interested in what I am doing. Kitty, that is not for you. Oh yeah, it's not for you. <laughs> oh, so good. So now we're just going to cook this until the meat is crispy. And the best way to get that to happen is to leave it alone. Let it get nice crispy on one bit. Leave it alone. Get crispy and then give it a toss around so that all, every single corner can get nice and golden and crispy and the perfect corn beef hash there you go and I kind of left it alone a bit to brown oh yeah it's getting super crispy <clears throat> and as I've done before add a bit more butter if you think that it needs it Just add a smidge, a smidge, of, oops, smidge of butter my smidge is different to your smidge <laughs> And you can enjoy it just like this, or you could fry an egg to enjoy on top of it. So while it's all in here, clear a bit of room in the middle, fry an egg or two. Oh yeah, that's just the perfect. You could have breakfast, lunch, dinner, breakfast for dinner, everything. Okay, wait, missing, mixing it around a little bit, and then following my own advice and leaving it alone. And there you go, that is done. So 
that is the recipe for today how to make low carb corn beef hash thanks so much for watching the video make sure that you leave a like and subscribe for more low carb keto diet inspiration recipes like this meal ideas what i eat in a day grocery hauls and weight loss updates i've got my six month keto anniversary coming up in a few days and i'll be sharing a video of my weight loss results experience and all of that so make sure that you subscribe to join the community and let me know what is your favorite way to enjoy corned beef hash what is your favorite flavor combo will you have an egg or will you not have an egg i look forward to reading your comments and we'll see you again soon bye